is up crew welcome back again it's your boy Mugen Strife aka the RPG Prodigy and I'm back again with another episode of Pokemon Rejuvenation in the last episode we arrived here on route 2 we encountered this girl named Nim and she jacked our wallet we ended up chasing her all around route 2 did a few battles and funny enough it turns out that she didn't steal our wallet but instead put it in another pocket in our bag we ended off last episode facing off against Nim. we got bodied for one time for the one time but hey we're gonna get her back this episode before we begin i just want to show you guys a few things first off i did a little bit of grinding so everybody is level 24 except the volbeat that i caught i caught this thing just because I, it randomly showed up. It's a level 18 and I'm just collecting it to collect it. I'm probably not going to be really using it. Trunk hasn't really received any levels. And that's mainly because he's just there to face tank most of the time. He's going to be the main hitter against her Soul Rock and Lunatone. So I'm not going to be too banking on him after the Soul Rock and Lunatone die. We got Sandy up to level 24 and she's looking good. She's ready. She's ready for this battle. But before we begin, I'm gonna do something interesting for the start off. I have a rare candy right here, and Sandy will be evolving in one level. I'm gonna be using this rare candy, and getting Sandy to that next form. So Sandy's gonna be evolving right now. Here we go. Alright, now Sandy's a Lycan Rock. And she wants to learn Excel Rock. That's actually a really good move. Yeah, it's priority. Yeah, I'll get rid of Rock though. And get Excel Rock. And that Sandy is currently our highest level Pokemon. Let's take a look at her stats. Got some good HP. That's a nice speed and nice attack, actually. Makes her the highest attack in our team, yeah. Yeah, and with Excel Rock, she'll do really well. And she's got Sand Rush, so in a Sandstorm, she'll be really quick. I'm gonna save it there. And we're gonna face off against Nim. Go oh, Nim! Alright, the final stretch, girl. Alright, you already saw all this. So I'm just gonna skip it for this time. And get to the battle. Yeah, we've seen your floating your Dragon Ball shit already. Alright, square up, Nim. This time, we're taking you down. Yeah, I already know you were gonna go with Soul Rock and Lunatone. Alright, this time, I'm gonna aim mainly for Lunatone. And try to hit him up with a flinch. Ah, didn't work. Yeah, they're going for the psychics. Ah, uh, Trunk flinched. Alright, I'm gonna use Bite again and then try to heal, heal up Trunk. I hope I can get a flinch at some point on this. Lunatone because that is annoying. Come on, get a flinch. Yes! Alright, I'm gonna bite, finish off the Lunatone. And I'm gonna use Razor Leaf. That rock slide stuff is getting real annoying. Alright, there's the NK. I'm gonna use Bite on Soul Rock, and then I'm gonna heal up Sandy. Because Trunk has done his job. He was here mainly just to tank the Soul Rock and Lunatone so that um, Flachender didn't have to come out and take all that. So Trunk's gonna go down, 
And now I'm gonna start working on the NK. As for the Soul Rock, um, I'm gonna use Priority Peck. No. Yeah, I'm gonna hit him with a Priority Peck. I th it should kill. Yeah, it killed. Just as I thought. Tiny's Rock Tomb should be really good here because it'll slow down the NK and it'll deal. Woo! I didn't expect it to crit Sandy you out here! Alright. Oh, holy crap. Yep. You in trouble now, girl. You in trouble now. Hit him up with that priority peck. Oh, wow. I didn't expect it to just completely ignore the priority peck. That was impressive. Oh, you trying to you trying to get away with the reflect. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. You catching this whoop. Sandy, hit him with that rock tomb and hit him with the ember. So even if he tanks the rock tomb... You're still going down to the ember. You dropped in speed, so you can no. There's no way you can outspeed for um, wildfire. All right, your power inspires me. Yeah, that time was easy, crew. Sandy, Sandy came in clutch once again. Darn, you're too strong for me. I knew you were strong because of how you defeated Venom, but I thought I had a shot. Hmm, that's either here nor there. You want fair and square? You're really something. I don't think it's. It's just to put you through all this trouble and not give you some sort of reward. So here, I'll give you this thing. Okay, so a Twisted Spoon, if we get a Psychic type, give that to him. Make him stronger. This is a Twisted Spoon, I created it myself. If you put this bad boy on a Pokemon, any Psychic type attack will be empowered. It's almost like I'm here by your side always. That's a little creepy to say, ain't it? But, you know what? I think I broke the barrier that uh, I think I broke that barrier a long time ago. Yeah, by spying and then you know following me here. Yeah, you did. Well, I'll bring you back home. Oop. You better save her, Mugen. I'll be watching you. All right, all right. I get it. We will rescue Melia. Ain't no way we failing. You get it, boys. All right. I'm gonna put Trunk up front. Because he's behind on levels. Wildfire and um, Sandy are already good to go. Hey, it looks like Mugen finally got here. Hey man, I, I, I got held up for reasons you won't believe. Heh, I see you've made it your choice. Am I missing something here? Whatever, we're here now. That's all that matters. No, not all we got to figure out is what direction we go in. Well, the exit to the cave is north. That's where Stride and Village is. Melian had uh, had to have gone that way. It's the only logical way she would have go. Yeah, you're right. Come on. Uh, she didn't go this way. What? How the hell do you know that? Who are you? It doesn't matter who I am, does it? The fact of the matter is that she didn't go this way. That's it. Why the hell wouldn't she go this way? You never experienced true fear, have you? What? If you've experienced true fear, you would understand why she made the wrong turn. Fear blinds the mind, cripples your intellect. When you succumb to your grasp of fear, sorry, to the grasp of fear, you make choices you wouldn't normally make. She took the wrong turn. She took the wrong turn? Damn it, Ren, what the hell did we do? Do we trust this guy or do we continue on our plan? I say we listen to him and go east. The reason? If Velia went north, that would mean she'd end up in Shiraiden Village. She'd be completely safe there. Shiraiden Village is home to a gym leader. You're right. That sensei dude or whatever. What if we went to Shiraiden and Melia did in fact take the wrong turn? She'd eventually be cornered and taken by Team Zen. If anything, our best bet is to just listen to what this person is telling us. Smart boy. You two should listen to him. He's got his mind in the right place. Yeah, yeah, whatever, I get it. Let's just hurry up, okay? Man, she ain't hurry. I get it. You gotta hurry and save Melia. Alright, so the correct way is to the right. I'm going to the left. And... Sounds like this, your boy wish he had them repels in his back pocket. I didn't buy any repel. Wait, I think I did. I'm gonna check my walk. I'm gonna check my backpack. I think I bought some repels. But before we go using them, I think it's best we at least check out what Pokemon we can get in here. And I swear if I see any Zubat, 
I'm gonna lose my mind. Gen 1 had me and Zubats in a wrong way when it came to caves. If I see, if I hear that Zubat screech, I'm, I'm gonna lose my mind. Drunk is that physical tank that don't care? Wow, this sentry has got that one true luck. All five swipes. Wow. I didn't think he'd get all five swipes. Okay, he loved that. And then hit him with the Razor Leaf. That should actually kill. Yep, there it is. And chip is magic. Okay. Got two AP. That's nice. Um, let me see. Did I get any? Yeah, I did. I have a super repel. I'm gonna take for a spin and just quickly look around this area. Mysterious stone. I'm gonna quickly just look around this area here to the left because the correct way is to the right. I just want to get this area looked over and get moving. Okay, I guess we can't really go that way. Obviously. All right, group. Let's get moving to the right, uh, to the right and find Melia. Oh, we're going downstairs? No. Oh. I'm just checking all the rocks. You know the business. Why are there all these? Okay, this is concerning. All right, we got an HP up. You know what we do with those? Screw. We give those to Trunk. There you go. We're gonna have a lot of HP when he evolves. Hmm. You know, I'd actually want one of these. As weird as it sounds. Yeah, the free antidote. Check the rocks, group. What's a lot of these Joltik? Joltik are native to Amethyst, aren't native to Amethyst Cave. It wouldn't be so weird if there were just one, but there are so many. I'm sure we'll find out the reason if we just continue. So let's just do that. You got that, Ren. You got that. Is this potion there? I'm gonna use that free potion, actually. Give Trunk a quick heal up. We're probably gonna encounter our healing um, thing later on. So. Ah, uh, my repel wore off. It looks like we've made the right decision. I defeated a Zen Grunt and I got them to spill the details. Melia definitely took the wrong turn. She's, well. Somewhere down there. And we're really high up here, aren't, aren't we? Are you scared of heights, Venom? Where's Ren? I'm here. Have you found anything? Yeah, we made the right decision. Mel Melia is on the floor beneath us. So, down there. You can barely see anything from here. Well, in any case, let's make our way down there now. There's no use talking about it. Right! Yep, let's get going, crew. The longer we wait up here, the more danger Melia is in. Okay, what Pokemon this be? Oh, it's the legendary Geodude. Hit him with the absorb. Ooh, one shot. And refill my HPs. Alright, let's hope That girl in the purple here was just too strong for me. How can kids be so tough? Simple. You suck at your job. Stop sucking. <laughs> Ooh, Meditite. That actually wouldn't be too bad. I actually might catch this. Yeah, and we can use it like as our psychic type and fighting type. Yeah, I might catch this meta type. This will be our fourth Pokemon. Well, fifth actually. Ah, uh, you dare break out! All right, challenge my skills a little bit. The ball thrown by the prodigy. Impossible. I know Zendura too. That's actually not bad. Metatite actually can be pretty useful. Very well. I'll throw this one, especially. Because we're in a cave, this should increase the catch chance. There we go. Hmm. Should I name it? I got it. 
Mm, I'll call you Insight. Oh, my bad. Missed the end. Yeah, I'll call you Insight. Reason for that, I want I was thinking naming it Insight, but I thought it would be more of a play on it just to name it Insight. And I'm gonna be training that. Oh, oh no! It has that legendary sand trap. Oh, I thought it had sand trap. Interesting. All right, let's look at insight. What do you got? Pure power. That is actually real good. And I am going to be doing EV training on this thing's attack. And probably its speed a little bit. Oh, it's got force palm. That's actually not bad. Okay, with some more training, it could actually be a really good many champ. Alright, let's keep going down. By the looks of things, oh yeah. There are gonna be some action up front. And I am thinking I want Sandy to be here. Just a feeling crew. And I don't think yeah, Trunk don't need no healing, but he don't need no healing, he cool. Oh, electric gem, that's actually interesting. If I could get one of these Joltik, I might switch out one of our Pokemon for the Joltik. Or keep it on the side as a, you know, have a graphic adventure as a side Pokemon would that wouldn't actually be such a bad idea. Oh, there's a Lunatone down here. Oh, and I got a free revive. Catching this Lunatone wouldn't be a bad idea either. Nothing here. Oh, it's a gourmet tree Pokemon. Mm, I'll think about it. When we get more money, crew, we'll be collect. I'll be collecting like all the gourmet tree Pokemon we have encountered so far. Oh, oh, you just gonna dangle an item up there like that? Come on, man, that's just mean. If we're dealing with Team Zen. I wouldn't be surprised if we. Oh, it's Zeta. Well, oh. ah. You finally caught up to me, huh? Your name was Mugen, right? That trainer with Melia. You caused a lot of damage, Mugen. A lot. The only one who has cause for any damage is you. Just who are you, anyway? Are you the boss of Team Zen? The boss? No. I'm far from that. Far... Far from that. You just... Then you're just, just a waste of our damn time. Where's Melia? I know you know where she is. Melia? Yes. I know exactly where she is. Melia is dead. But what? What are you going on about? This is no time for your stupid jokes. You think I'm joking? On my pursuit to capture Melia, I found something that confirms her fate. A Gavantula was feasting upon her bag. You, you can't be serious. I won't believe anything you say until you show proof. Well then, Zeta, where's your undeniable proof? You want your damn proof? Well then, here it is. This is... Melia's back. No, this can't be. This has to be a mistake. There's no mistake. No mistake. No mistake at all. Everything is ruined. Everything that existed to be Melia is now gone in the blink of an eye. There were so many things we needed her for. Things I needed her for. And all because Mugen wanted to meddle in our affairs, they had no business being a part of. Don't you dare try to put the blame on Mugen for this. If all you had tried, sorry, if you all hadn't tried to capture Melia, this wouldn't have been, sorry, this wouldn't have happened in the first place. English should be hard. And we were too slow to do anything. No. You were just in time, actually. What? Is that a... 
You see what's behind me, right? You two may not know what this is, but Mugen sure does. The Dimensional Rift. With it, I will obliterate all three of you where you stand. You three will know the pain you've caused, Team Zen. And you will know the pain you've caused, Melia! I'm a partner with Iran for this one. Let's do this for Melia! Bros gotta stick together when we squads going in. A Dratini and a Sneasel! Woo! Okay, that's actually... That's actually a threat. Okay. Lycanroc should be the fastest thing here. Hit him up with that sand too. Oh, you damn right! Strength of my rock attacks, boy! One shot! The yeah, rock attacks I don't think work on. Oh, and the shockwave. Oh, the gloom. Mm, I want to switch out. Alright, use bite on gloom. Department wants to switch out. But I feel it probably would suit me better if I just kept the gloom. Oh, this gonna be a pain. It knows Giga Drain. Oh no. Mm. I'm gonna try bite again. I wanna try and get the flinch on Gloom. If I get the flinch on Gloom, then I can start working on him. Oh, the icy wind. The speed drop too. Ooh, now that's actually not expected. I didn't expect him to know icy wind actually. Oh, not the dragon breath. Yeah, fuck you're going down with that. Oh, this is gonna hurt. It's gonna hurt Sandy for sure. Oh no. Yeah, that that actually hurts Sandy. That that actually really hurts Sandy. All right, I'm gonna use. Mm, all right, something tells me. You know what? I think it's better that we just focus on the balloon for now. If we can get the flinch off, I think Rain can handle it. They're probably gonna aim for Sandy with that. Yeah, Sandy's still weak from her back from getting hit with that stuff. Okay, he's not gonna get much healing off of Sandy, so it's fine. And I can just send in um Yeah, I can send in wildfire to clean up. Alright, hit him up with that ember. Okay, swapped up to Minor. That's actually pretty bad for me actually. I use acid though. Oh, it hit both of us. Okay, that's why. Shouldn't Minor's thing be have been shattered? Oh no, it's when he it passes a certain point of ink of HP. Ah, oh, you suck. Bring that gloom back out. Don't be a punk. Bring gloom back out. Oh, this is gonna hurt. This is actually gonna one shot, I think. Oh yeah, there's no way Sandy living that. Oh boy. Yeah, there's no way Sandy was gonna live that crew. Empowered? Ancient power? That, that, that was guaranteed the one shot. Alright, I'm gonna send Trump guy. He can get some XP from this. Oh, come on. A Quilava? Oh, this won't hurt. Yeah, there was no way Cagney was gonna live that. Okay, ancient power shouldn't do much to Trunk. Because Trunk is a physical tank. That won't even hurt. Oh! Oh boy, that actually hurt more than I thought it would. Alright, all right. I am gonna heal. Yeah, we may want to use that revive on Sandy. We're kind of looking, we're kind of leaking. Yeah, I might use the revive on Sandy. We're gonna need her to deal with that Quilava. Okay, the ancient power should actually take out Trump here. I didn't think it would actually be that strong, but it is. And there goes Trump. I think Quilava comes in with that flame burst. Yeah, when it think next turn you can you can take out the Minor.
No, I'm taking out the Minnow right now with Excel Rock. Yeah, I'm taking that. Oh, not it had no double kick. I didn't think it knew double kick. That is actually a surprise. Why do you know Dazzling Gleam? That too is a surprise. Alright, I'm gonna finish it off. Finish off the Palava. That's actually more pressing right now for us. Than the Blue. She, the Blue may use Giga Drain, but oh, stabilize faster. Okay, that saves us. That saves us a lot of trouble. And with that, we win. Oh, I thought we had that. Oh, actually, that's not bad. It's actually a good idea. Sandy should be faster. And then using the Rock Tomb, it's definitely gonna get faster. Yeah, it drops its speed. Hit yourself. Hit yourself. Hit yourself. Oh, you had a citrus berry. You are the worst. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, no way Sandy will leave that. Hmm. Oh, no, I want to do this. Alright, I'm going to send out... Alright, now I'm going to use Detect. I know you know... I know you know you know Shadow Claw. But I'm basically just using this to bait out his attacks while Sableye finishes him off. Okay, that's good. I can try hitting him with a Force Palm. I don't know if Sable if um the insight's gonna be faster. Hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself. Ah, uh, that sucks. I think we, we might. Yeah, Insight got knocked out from that. Definitely not gonna survive that. Hmm, who do I want to get this? Yeah, I'm gonna give it to Grimer. And that should be his last Pokemon. Grimer gonna get a lot of HP from this. You guys seriously don't know when to quit! So, it looks like I lost. Again. Yes, you did! Now give it up! And turn yourself in, Zeta! Turn myself in? What a bunch of nonsense! Have you forgotten about my friend behind me? You know, that thing? I wasn't able to defeat you three because I was weak. But that but that won't be the case for the rift. I command this rift to absorb and destroy you. Oh no not this again! What what's going on? Just just try to fight it. It's no good. It's too strong. And we in another rift. Oh boy. Rift Lethal Forest. Man, where are we? Presumably the dimensional rift Zeta mentioned earlier. Last thing I remember is being absorbed by that ball of dark energy. The rift. Well, damn. At least this place looks cool. It's right up my alley. Just look at the color of this water. I want to take something from my gym. Venom, don't touch that. Don't be stupid. What if it's corrosive? Um, good point. I'll just leave it be then. Well, anyway, there's got to be something around here we can use to escape this place. Oh, hey, check it out, Ren. Logan. That Pokemon is called Joltik, right? Or, no, it can't be. It's different. Is it shiny? It definitely looks like one, but no. This is something entirely different. Come here, little guy. I won't hurt you. You killed it! Killed it? I, I didn't. All I did was touch it. Forget about it. Let's just keep take a look around. Alright. Alright, crew. We need to take a quick look around. See what's going on. Okay, there we go. There's the heels. Oh, there's another piece of data here. Downloading, downloading. 
This data contains the data for code Maternia. Materna. Let's take a look at that. Rift Dex. Materna. Electric and Poison. Fueled off rage caused by the girl who sealed its fate. Conventionally burnt, conventionally burning passion to protect its young lives on. Harmony's children will anger it greatly. And it is a... Oh yeah, you're not... We're not gonna damage this thing by special attack. So it's a defensive one. So I guess we just touch these, these, these Joltik and... Boom, it just gets going. We have... Yeah, we're gonna use Sandy for this one. This is strange. The Joltik I interact with is back here. Maybe we must interact with all the Joltik. Okay. Why is there a giant egg here? You are telling me. I don't know. I guess we just gotta interact with all the Joltik. Here's the question. Is there anything else around here besides just the Joltik? Just checking out all the trees, just in case I find something. I don't look like there is anything. Alright, let's quickly save crew before we get into this fight. We don't want anything bad happening. It looks like all the Joltik Mugen found gather themselves around this huge egg. Does that mean they're here for, well, you know, no venom. Your in implications are scaring me, so stop. But what? I didn't mean it like that. I meant they might be gathering because the egg is about to hatch. Oh, that makes more sense anyway. That's definitely possible. Ren, Mugen, it's hatching. That's a tail, right? That's a tail! Yeah, that's a definitely a tail. What do we do now? Do we have to do anything? I'm thinking we may have to. We need to do something about this now. Mugen, who do you want to partner with? I am going with Ren because it is a poison and um... It's a poison and electric type. We kind of might need Ren for this one. And it is the Rift Cavantula. Oh boy. Alright, it's definitely gonna send out a bunch of Joltik at us. I am gonna be using the rock throw, using our rock tomb to just take out these Joltik as quickly as possible. Didn't his, um. Oh, not the electro web. Okay, it hits both of us. Alright, I'm just gonna keep taking out um, the Joltik. Okay, if they're just gonna keep spamming Electro Whip, I might switch. And heal. Yeah, no way Frogadier is gonna live through this turn. Okay, that was impressive. I'm gonna, not gonna lie, that was impressive. Okay, there's Gavantula. Alright, I am mainly gonna be aiming for the Gavantula. I can probably guess the Gavantula is gonna be aiming for Frogadier. Uh, if they're gonna spam Electro Web, this is actually gonna be a problem. That Gavantula scares me. That shouldn't kill? Okay, yeah, I do. I am actually going to switch Pokemon. It's gonna use an electric type move, so I'm gonna switch out to Trunk. Trunk should be able to tank it. Giving us at least a turn to heal up. Yeah, that electro web spam, it is dangerous. Okay, 
That shouldn't be much of a fight. Yeah, it isn't. Woof. Everything they have hits multi-hitting. That is actually a problem. Okay, so Darkness is powering up his attacks. Uh... Yeah, I have a potion. I'm using it from Sandy. That should not kill. But that's definitely gonna kill the Sableye. Oh, he survived? No, I'm actually impressed! Okay, that's actually... That's actually not bad for me. It's gonna kill the Sableye, that's no doubt about that. But that's not bad for me in the regard that actually gives me an extra turn to heal up. So I get an extra turn to give Sandy more HP. That's actually not bad for me. If, with any luck, I hope... Okay, Trunk avoided this one. That's actually not bad. But it's definitely gonna use Struggle Bug. It's definitely gonna use Struggle Bug. If it doesn't, the AI is stupid. Yeah, there it is. Yeah, it's definitely gonna use the Struggle Bug, and Trunk is definitely gonna go down. So is the Cacnea. Alright, I'm gonna send out Sandy. Why didn't you send that out earlier? Alright, we're gonna hit up the Joltik with the Rock Tube. I think this is the last Joltik? Don't quote me. Okay, that's gonna do some damage. All right, I'm up with the flame burst. All right, I'm gonna hit him with the with a rock tomb and then an excel rock, and then that should be all that Sandy has got right now. Like everything Sandy can do for this moment. Yeah, I've been lowering its speed. God should be able to hit it with a bite. Darkness, the darkness should increase it. Oh, actually. Sandy might be able to take it out. Yeah, with stab, with stab, accelera. Yeah, that's actually priority right there. Sandy with the swiftness, and there it goes. Vatula, I understand your anger. However, it's time to rest once and for all. Did we do it? I think so. So, um, what do we do now? You gotta be kidding me! No. How did they? We back! What's with you three? How were you- How is it that you were able to defeat my dimensional rifts? It's over, Zeta. We kicked your ass twice in a row. Is there anything else you'd like to show the class? Shut your mouth! I don't know how you three were able to pull off defeating me and my rifts, but there's one thing I know for sure. You three aren't leaving this place alive! That's enough, Zena. Stop talking. Th that voice! Who the hell are you? The name of this elegant woman who is sacrificing y your her pride to appear I believe the name Crescent will do. Yes, Crescent is a beautiful name. It's quite important to me. That aside, I believe it's time we cage up these uncontrollable animals. No. S stay away from me, you, you. You know, I've grown quite bored of your voice. You're the only one who I know, at least, that can create those riffs. So I think I'm ready to silence you. What's this? Are you feeling fear? Don't you know that that's what monsters like me feed off of? You aren't so tough the moment you're in a losing position. Though I suppose that's true for most people. I guess you're just like most people then, Zeta. Absolutely pathetic. No! Get away from me! You don't know anything about me! J just shut your mouth! 
Goodbye, Zeta. See you soon. What did you do with Zeta? That's inconsequential. You two, Ren, and Mugen. I told you back at the lab that this path would only bring despair. It seems as though you've decided to ignore those claims. We didn't ignore them. We just chose to act upon them in a way we saw fit. And what did that amount to? It accounted to nothing but blood on your hands. Blood that won't come off no matter how hard you scrub. Melia is dead, and there is absolutely no changing that. Who do you think you are? You can't go around telling us we have blood on our hands. We tried our best to save her. Oh, that sorry, Kree, that one just flew right by. You tried your best at it. At night, then believe you're angry. Okay, sorry. But what's done is done. I have nothing else to say to you, you all. Go home and leave Team Zen to the people who actually know what they're doing. Au revoir. Goodbye. Damn her! Melly has gone. She is. But we can't give up here. We have to fight Team Zen so we can avenge her death. No. I'm going back to Giren City. What? Why? That skank was right. We couldn't do anything to save Melia. We weren't strong enough. So I'm going back to Giren City to become stronger. I'll crush anyone who gets in my way. And then, finally, when I'm stronger, I'm going after Crescent and Team Zen for what they've done. Okay. Then I'll get stronger too. Well, when I do, I'll join you, Venom. Hm. I'll hold you to that. I'm leaving. Don't forget what happened here. What about you, Mugen? What will you do? Will you become stronger by taking on the League? If that's the case, then you want to head north. There's a village at the end of this cave called Shiraiden Village. There's a gym leader there who will face you if you challenge him. As for me, there's no way I, way I can become strong. So there's only one way I can become stronger, and that's fixing my hometown, Golden Leaf Town. So that's why I'm going to head next. We'll meet again soon, Mugen. All right, Ren. When we join hands next time, we dropping them. Okay, let's just check this just in case. Welcome to the background. Something interesting. Room ID card. Okay. Anything else? Okay, no. All right, crew. That's why I'm gonna cut the recording. This one was a really lengthy episode, but we took on Team Zen. It turns out Melia is dead. Damn. What can we do? Well, we're gonna get her, get him back for this. I promise you. Like and subscribe for more content. This has been your boy, the RPG Prodigy, and I'll catch you guys next episode. Peace. Tell me pretty lies. Look me in the face. Tell me that you love me, even if it's fake.